When it comes to analyzing customer activity on your website, you can import your conversions from Google Analytics 4 into Google Ads for conversion tracking and measurement. Importing your Google Analytics conversions into Google Ads offers a few benefits. You can see Google Analytics conversion data in Google Ads, optimize campaigns and ROI by consolidating your conversions in Google Analytics and bidding directly against them in Google Ads. Give smart bidding access to data that helps optimize bids and deliver more value to your business. Access other Google Ads capabilities, such as data-driven attribution, a custom attribution model that is specific to your account. Measure the impact of YouTube ads in the customer journey leading to conversions, including cross-device conversions. In this tutorial, we'll walk you through how to get GA4 set up before importing into Google Ads. The first step is setting up conversion measurement in GA4. The data in Google Analytics 4 reports come from events that users trigger as they interact with your websites and apps. To measure conversions, select the events most important to your business and mark them as conversion events. To start tracking a new event as a conversion, follow the next steps. First, in the left navigation, click Configure. You will be informed that the Configure settings will be moved into Admin section. So let's click Go to Admin. Once in the Admin section, find Events under your selected property and click. Above your events already created, click on Create Event. If you see a data stream prompt, please select the data source you'd like to connect. Then click Create. Now, to create an event to measure, we recommend these steps. Enter a unique name in the custom event name field. In our case, it will be shop. Below, in the value field of the first row of matching conditions, enter the existing event name. Now click Add Condition. Once you have a second condition added, click on the parameter field of the second row and select Page Location from the drop-down menu. In the operator field, select Contains, Ignore Case. And finally, enter the name of the page in the value field. Now click Create. You will see the new event in the Custom Events table. Close the Create Events panel. Note, the new event will not show up in the existing events table until later. Once your new event appears in the list, you can mark it as a conversion. Now, in the left navigation, let's click Conversions and New Conversion Event. Enter the exact name of the event in the New Event Name field and click Save. Then you will find the new conversion event in the Conversion Events table marked as a conversion. If you already have conversions set up as goals in UA, they can be imported to GA4, but will now be referred to as events in GA4. If you've used the GA4 Setup Assistant or Dual Tagging, the category, action, and label values from your Universal Analytics events are automatically translated to GA4 events and parameters. The second step is linking your Google Ads and Google Analytics accounts. Watch this video to learn more about how to do this. The third step is ensuring that auto-tagging is enabled. Before importing goals from Google Analytics to Google Ads, it's important to set up auto-tagging in your Google Ads accounts. This allows conversions to be attributed to Google Ads clicks. Let's see how to enable auto-tagging in your Google Ads accounts. First, sign in to your Google Ads account. In the left page menu, click Settings and Account Settings. Now open the auto-tagging section. Let's check the box Tag the URL that people click through for my ad to enable auto-tagging and click Save. The last step before importing data is to activate Google Signals in order to also import cross-device conversions from Google Analytics. To do this, go back to your Google Analytics account. In the left navigation, click Admin. Under Account, select the account that the roll-up property belongs to. Under Property, select the relevant property. From the property list, select Data Collection. Once in the Data Collection for Google Signals section, let's switch the toggle on. Now navigate to each source property where you want to enable Google Signals, and in the Data Collection for Google Signals section, switch the toggle on. Well done! Now you are ready for the last step, to import Google Analytics data to Google Ads. To complete this step, let's go back to our Google Ads account 
and click the Tools and Settings icon in the upper right corner of your account. Then, click Conversions and New Conversion Action. Now, let's select Import and choose that you want to import data from Google Analytics 4. Make sure to select Web from the two options below. Once you've set up the new conversion action, click Continue. On the next page, select the features that you'd like to import, then click Import and Continue. Finally, click Done. Google Ads will begin importing the data from your analytics property. Note that historical data from before the import won't be included. You're now all set to measure and optimize to Google Analytics conversions within Google Ads. For more step-by-step -step videos on Google Ads implementation and optimization, check out Google Ads tutorials on the Google Ads channel.